Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I wanted to do a quick update on the uh, state of the property. The last video I did um, with the John Deere mowing was from a couple of weeks ago. So I feel like the grass has definitely filled in and greened up a little bit more since we've had uh, a lot of warm weather and sun. And um, I just wanted to kind of show you some clips of the property uh, to catch you up, you know, to its current state. Uh, I've sanded a couple of areas, as you'll see in some of these clips. Um, we're getting a little bit of dollar spot right here that you see, which we have treated with fungicide. But overall, Green County fertilizers, the aerate, RGS, all of those chemicals have really made a difference on the lawn. And the current height of cut is half an inch, or a little bit actually less than half an inch. So it's looking pretty good. Um, but there is some low spots that I need to fill in with sand. This property is by no means perfectly flat. And I'm getting a little bit of settling where there was some irrigation trenches and the gas line installed when this house was first built. So that definitely needs to be addressed. Um, we have to take care of this flower bed, straighten out the grass and the mulch and put in spring flowers here, as you see. But um, everything's growing good. The trees are coming out pretty good. They're putting on new growth. This is a blue atlas cedar that you'll see right here. And it has a lot of new growth on it as well. So I just wanted to get you guys caught up on the current state. Um, the last video I had to mow it with the John Deere because the Toro actually broke a drive belt. And I had ordered one and I was waiting for about five days for it to come in. And the grass was getting long, so I went ahead and mowed it with the John Deere just to keep it, you know, at the proper height until I got the Toro replaced or got the Toro up and going again. So the Toro is back in commission and it is mowing perfectly well. So from here on out, hopefully we'll have more videos of the Toro in action. But um, as you can see here, all the plants are looking good. The uh, window boxes, obviously, we'll put new annuals in those and we'll replace these annuals in the flower bed, as you see here. Japanese maples are looking good. The creeping Jenny is starting to creep underneath the tree, as you see here. Um, so, yeah, it's looking pretty good. There is a little bit of sanding along the edge, and that's what the white stuff is along the edge right here. It's just um, some coarse sand. And... Um, so yeah, that's it. Everything's doing good. Um, like I said, I just wanted to catch you guys up on it. And that way from here on out, you'll be caught up since the last video was from a couple of weeks ago. So once again, I appreciate all of you, your kind words, your comments. I appreciate you taking your time and, and watching this. I hope you learned something or at least see um, the hard work that goes into this. And we will see you on the next one. Thanks.